Remember, there are a lot of non-physical aspects to the disease, and one such is autonomic failure, meaning your automatic circuits start to fail, and one such is your stomach. That's why you get constipation for years before you even manifest Parkinson's. And as the disease progresses, that same problem goes upstream all the way up into your stomach. So meaning any pills which go into your stomach just stays there many times. Only half of it goes further down. Why do we care how it pushes down? Because levodopa is not absorbed in the stomach. It is absorbed in the first part of your intestine, which means Anything which we take by mouth has to make it to the first part of your intestine for absorption. So if it stays in the stomach for the next one hour, it ain't kicking in. If only one of the two tablets at a, at a time which you take went through, you only get a partial switch on. These are all the variations which come because your stomach is no longer your friend. This is why we always say, when you start taking levodopa, practice the habit of taking it on an empty stomach with a nice tall glass of water to literally flush it down the toilet till it gets to the intestine. This way the absorption is as wholesome as it can be and you can limit some of those erratic, unpredictable fluctuations. <laughs>